Tim Harrington. Hey, why do you always start things with hey like that? My name is Tim Harrington. Hey, I'm from the band Les Savi Fav. I'm here with my dog. Say rerun. Rerun is a miniature schnauzer. Or I guess she's five now. Closing in on five. There was like talk about making babies. And uh, some people are like, you might have heard this, you like get a dog first to see if it doesn't die. It's like a canary. First, I guess you start with the canary to see if the canary in the coal mine dies, and then you get a dog. I was really emphatic about like oh, I don't want one of the a little froof dog that like my wife would walk around like in guy the guys and dolls movie. Like my wife would walk around with a little dog, and it would like always want to bite me, and she'd be like Fruity Puchus, no. She actually now is kind of a teeny weeny like her dog, but. She's not mean to me. She doesn't snap at me and my wife doesn't hold her like this and have colossal bosoms and wear a pearl earring, pearl glasses holders. None of those things happen. We just have a cute puppy. She's come in when the band's been recording in like our, at the like recording studio and been a good mascot. Ren, do you do any tricks? She doesn't want to talk. Do you, does that happen every time you get really good dog responses? Excuse me, everyone. Can I talk to you about the uh, images you posted on Twitter of your uh, body parts? No comment. Another thing Rira and I really like to do, and you probably see me do because I can do it habitually, is pick her little uh, eyeball eye boogers and feed them to her. Always, always, always. We when we what we do that no one else in the family does with her. Other people will pet her. Other people will snuggle her. But I'm the only one who cleans her eye boogers and puts, lets her eat them. And I also, if she gets a dreadlock, pull the dreadlock. She likes to eat the dreadlocks. She operates in two modes. One is total stealth ninja, where you, like I walk her without a leash, and I'll be like, where did she go? And looking all around, I can't find her. And she's perfectly situated in my exact blind spot, silently following. When my wife got pregnant, she got became like a panty devouring dog and also a uh, barking really loud at all kids that aren't ours dog. And so her other mode is fierce attack. And it can be pretty, pretty spooky. Well, it's not that fierce, but mostly she barks and runs away. When each of my kids were born, uh, <laughs> like in some weird stupor of exhaustion, went to like go buy milk or something, brought Rion with me, and then walked home and left her uh, on the collar tied in front of the bodega, and then like an hour later was like, where's the, oh my gosh, and go back in the room and be sitting out front all depressed and bummed out. But you forgave me. She doesn't like going to the dog park. Never did. We used to take her to McCarran Dog Park all the time. She'll sniff a butt, but she doesn't want anyone sniffing hers. She's very private about her business. Right? Whose butt? A dog person is like needy and needs reassurance, and a cat person uh, is self-loathing and needs something that doesn't care for them. What about a fish person? <laughs> a fish person doesn't need anything. They're just like, hey fish. Oh, I'll show you guys a trick that all dogs have. It's a classic dog trick. Period. Wizard. Psh. 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 Have you guys ever seen that before? Psh. All dogs can do wizard. Like that's like a spell casting. Thing. <laughs>